They say my own thoughts keep me in this state of mind because I'm not letting go. For the past 10 years I tried everything. Nothing worked. It's like I have two persons living inside of me. One who's reasonable and another one who keeps on living in the past, fueling regrets and irrational thoughts and taking control over me. So I have developed a theory of my own. I truly believe I could live a normal life if I get rid of all the memories, the irrational thoughts and the negative thinking patterns deeply rooted inside my mind. Of course no one approves me, and all of this seems barbaric and experimental, but I know what I'm doing, and, and frankly I don't know what else to do. I do want to live a normal life. A carefully designed sequence of signals applied by a specific algorithm could help me. But the balance is difficult to achieve. Too little and it has no effect. Too much and it could kill me. Did it work? Joanna used to love this soup, and Marta Marta shows the joy of Today I try again, a new sequence, higher signal levels, improved algorithm. Also, I'm gonna sync the signals with my own heartbeats.
This time it worked. I can feel it. so proud of me to see what I have accomplished. If they were here... A combination of electric signals, like the one I use, with a mild electromagnetic field, could permanently damage, erase, a person's memory. The risk is higher. If the field is too much, if something goes wrong, the brain could forget how to think, how to breathe, how to trigger a heartbeat. On the other hand, if everything goes fine, and I survive, I won't remember anything. My family, the accident, the past 10 years, hell, I won't even remember how to read or write or how to use a fork. I won't be I anymore. I will be you. So it's sort of a death, one way or another. But I guess that's okay. I died 10 years ago anyway. I wish I could meet you. A grown-up man with a fully developed brain, with no more information inside than a toddler, learning everything all over again, seeing the world with fresh eyes again. <laughs> a clean slate. A life reboot. A new first kiss. A new first love. God, I would die to see that. I hope you'll live to see this message. I want you to know I'm not crazy. I hope you can understand me. They say it's less likely to forget the spoken language. Reading and writing though, well, you'll probably have to learn it again. The green drawings are called letters and they make the alphabet. I'm recording everything you need to know and I'm giving you everything you need so you can start learning. It will be a process in time. A new life should start without the habits of the old one.
I have to let you go. Just like they say, make room for new memories. Who will I be when I'll no longer know who I am? Hello John, I want you to know I am not crazy and neither are you. Maybe you are afraid, but remember, you can do anything you want to do. Just go outside, learn everything, try everything, meet new people, make all the mistakes, live free. This is your second chance. It seems I had a previous life, and now I have a new one. I don't quite get it, but it doesn't matter. I like this life. It looks awesome. <laughs>